Welcome back to the channel guys, you got Jake here, aka the Kentucky Dipper, coming at you once again with another Chew review. This will be going into our Chew playlist. And yeah, I would call it a budget Chew. Um, the price on this bad boy is $1.99 for a pouch. Um, so yeah, before we get started though, I'd just like to say uh, if you're new here to the channel, please leave a like on the video. Be sure to hit that subscribe button, that way you're up to date with all videos I post here. Uh, and if you like dip and chew, then this you're in the right place, because that's what we do. Um, anyways, today we're going to be taking a look at Stoker's Red supreme bold chewing tobacco ladies and gentlemen um as you can see on the pouch here you got uh it's a black background um with of course red lettering bold going down here quality tradition value warning label this is a three ounce pouch, which is like your standard. Um, as all Stoker's products are, this is made by National Tobacco Company out of Louisville, Kentucky, and it has got a leaf content um no less than 19 percent domestic and no more than 81 percent foreign so yeah this is mainly foreign tobacco used in this but we're gonna we're gonna bust into it um this is obviously still sealed go ahead and pop that open And as you can see, it does have a zip lock and it is very fresh. I've been keeping this in my fridge for about a week now, so looking forward to this. Um, right off the bat to the touch, it feels pretty sticky and pretty tacky, I'll say. Um, Definitely a tacky touch to the fingers. Um, I'm not going to do a real big chew just because I'm on time constraint uh, as I'm making this video. So, as you can see, it's a your standard chewing tobacco cut. It is dark. Not very many light pieces in that. Um, it's mainly all pretty much dark. Um, smell, it kind of reminds me of Red Man a little bit. Just the way it smells. Um, and yeah. That's probably about all I have to say. And it is also moist. <laughs> Of course. Um, so yeah, cheers ladies and gentlemen. If you got a dip or two and want to throw in one with me, now is the time. Cheers ladies and gentlemen. All right. It's got a real sweet, it's really sweet. Mm. Little bit of that uh, typical raisiny flavor that you get with like Red Man or you're just standard too. But it's not like 
I mean, there's this sweetness underneath that. And... Mmm. Mmm. It's actually really good. Wow. It's like... It's juicing. It's juicing pretty good. Wow. Mmm. As you can see, spits dark. As chew should. I mean, you're literally chewing on the leaf, so... You better spit black. Okay, so let's talk about it here. This right here. If you chew tobacco and you're on a budget. Highly recommend you go try this. And I know, I think they have two types of the Red Supreme. Um... This one's the bold one, obviously, but I'm actually really impressed. I mean, it's not surprising because it's a Stoker's product, but at the same time, it is surprising because it's $1.99. Two bucks. And that's like... It's de it feels a little different than the Stoker's Apple too, to me. Um, mm -hmm. The Stoker's Apple, I feel like was softer and I feel like that has to do with the flavoring process of that. It kind of tends to start breaking apart more as you're chewing it. Um, this kind of reminds me more of what you'd find with Red Man, where this just kind of it's just there, you know. It's it's not breaking up really easy. Um, you can just lightly chew on it and it's holding its form pretty well. It's comfortable. It's not a, uh, yeah, man, this is just all around. I'm very, I'm very pleased with this. Um, I'm not a big chew person. I don't, uh, there's not really, I don't really see the reason to chew um i i'm solely uh chewing for these reviews because the nicotine content in chew is next to none like there's just if you are looking for nicotine which is why i dip to begin with you're not wanna, gonna want to chew every day. Um, you know, I this one little pouch could last me a long time because I'm I'm not gonna be chewing all the time. I literally only do it every once in a while when I want to switch things up. So that's what I. I'm going to hold on to that forward, but man, this is a one really good, decent budget dip, not dip, chew, sorry, I'm so used to doing dip reviews. This is a really good budget chew, uh, if you got $2 in your pocket and you're looking for a chew, Go get you a bag of this. It's tending to keep its flavor pretty well. Um, you know, 
and like I said, it's holding form, just sitting nice in the cheek, and it's there's it's just a nice uh, blend of uh, there's this sweetness and really nice tobacco flavor coming from it. Um, so on a scale of one to ten. Mm. I'm giving it a nine because I really like this. Um, it's ridiculously fresh. It's holding up good in the mouth. It's sitting well. It's comfortable. Um, and it's got a really nice flavor. All in all, like this is. I've only had a handful of chews, but I'm going to have to go ahead and say this is one of the better chews I've ever had, hands down. Um, now, in coming weeks, we are going to be breaking into some more chew videos, hopefully, um, if we have the funds. So, we will see about that. But, yeah. Um... Go get you some. Try it for yourself. If you chew this, let me know what you think. Leave a comment down below. And let's talk about it. I'm Jake, a.k.a. The Kentucky Dipper. And I appreciate you guys uh, popping in and check out the video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Y'all be safe.